Yeah, we got a 1985 Buick Regal T-Type WH1, also known as a designer series. Only 525 were made in 85. This car is 99% original. The only 1% would be the wheels. As you can see, those are the 86-7 style rims. And they were repainted. I wouldn't say they were restored, but they were repainted with new tires. So the car has four tire, new tires, and they were that was a year ago, but they only have literally 50 miles on them. That's it. Um, yeah, a person could uh, polish up these spokes and take it to that next level, you know, and then clear them if you wanted to really set them off but it's got all new center caps uh, again uh, those tires have maybe 50 miles on them uh, car is laser straight completely rust free 100 percent rust free i mean it really is there's nothing other than maybe like a tiny bit of surface rust on the frame you know nothing bad just minor surface you could just lightly brush it up and, and put some uh, chassis black or whatever that that coating is on there and it would be good so uh, I'm selling this car as needing a repaint it's original paint you can see see there again no dents at all no dents not even door dings this thing Antenna's a little bent. It doesn't go up and down. It's a power antenna. It doesn't work. You can see the badging there. A uh, little scrape there. This isn't dented in. It's just uh, a little scrape. It's not dented. Again, new tires. Chrome is like brand new. Still has that lower air dam piece. Even still has the white strip and the bumper uh, guard. One little crack there. Some bug chips, you know. Original paint. It's. I would recommend a repaint for sure. But you just don't find them this this solid like this. Well, I should say you do, but for a much bigger price. You can see the paint there. Again, laser straight. No dings. All it needs is a repaint to really take it to that next level. Back bumper, like new, no rust. Show you under the doors here. Dash has no cracks. Just this plate on top, which can be replaced. Very clean. Seats are like new, honestly. Back seat looks like brand new. But it does need a headliner. As you can see. Doors shut tight, they don't sag. Suspension is tight as a drum. The brakes are perfect. Stops on a dime. I mean, the steering is a tight. It, it drives like new. 58,000 original miles. Uh, the speedometer makes a clicking sound. It does come with a new speedometer. Or I should say a used one with the same mileage on it. And then uh, the heater control unit. It needs to be replaced. Uh, the little, I'll show you that inside. But, uh, 
we'll show you under the hood. Completely original, completely. Brand new battery, even has the little uh, battery tender hookups. Completely original, 58,000. Obviously had a new alternator and hoses at some point. But oil's actually still pretty clean. New uh, brake unit. That's the Hydra Boost. Works awesome. That's a great system. Stops on a dime. We'll have her fire it up. Runs like a top, guys. I mean, this, this car runs, it really does run good. Very tight, no knocks, no ticks. It's, it's a great engine. Never been abused. And shut her down. Take it for a spin. smoke. Yeah, let's take it for a little drive. Yep, everything works. You can see the tack works. Gas gauge works. Speedometer kind of clicks. Again, it comes with a spare one. This thing here doesn't quite work right, but I do uh, include a replacement uh, used part that looks to be in good shape, so... Uh, radio kind of works. Like how we try to get out. The cassette player is broken. Doesn't work. Uh, the AC would need to be recharged. Power windows work. They're slow, but they do work. They go down quickly, but they're... I guess it's a little quicker than I thought. Let's check that one. Okay. And yeah, the passenger side's a little slow, but I mean it works just fine, you know. Typical of something 35 years old. But yeah, let's uh, let's take you for a little drive. You can see it idles just beautifully. We'll. Uh, Very tight, goes down the road straight. You can let go of the wheel, the alignment's really good. It stops really, really good. I mean, you barely touch it. It's almost too touchy sometimes. It stops just awesome. Uh, the turbo boost's okay. Uh, that was only about a third of the throttle, so... Uh, for, for just, for an 85, it, it, it goes decent, you know? Uh, but everything works perfectly on it. It runs great, it cruises nice down the road. Straight. Not much else to say. I mean, just a great car, it needs a headliner and a paint job, and you'll have yourself a showpiece. I'm going to cut it off. Thanks for watching.